This video shows a simple method of setting up a sectional mast to support a portable antenna. In this video, one person sets up and takes down a 9 meter or 28 foot mast in just a few minutes at a very casual pace. Start by staking out at least two of the guy ropes. The positions don't need to be exact. You can make adjustments after you have it up. Here, the mast is set up on a level lawn using tent stakes, and the locations could be measured off more accurately if desired. In practice, conditions are rarely this favorable, and distances are simply estimated. Notice how the guy ropes are bundled, so the rope easily pulls out of the bundle without tangling. This is explained in the video on winding rope. The guy rope lengths are typically one and a half to two times the height of the mast. The anchor should be spaced out from the base by at least the height of the mast if they are at ground level. Wider spacing may work better, and trees or other objects are often used. Each guy rope is tied with an adjustable taut line hitch. Assemble enough sections of the mast that it will stand up when leaning against two of the guy ropes. Pick up the next section in one hand, then pick up the bottom of the mast in the other hand while moving enough to keep the mast leaning against the ropes. Add the new section to the bottom of the mast and set it back down, still leaning against the ropes. Repeat this process for each mast section, moving slightly towards the guy anchors each time as needed. With a heavy mast, one or two people can lift the mast while another person inserts the next section. Once all the sections have been added, tie off the third guy rope and straighten the mast. At this point, the guy ropes and anchors can be readjusted as desired. If you are putting up an antenna on the mast, once it is in a desired position and all the guy ropes are adjusted, lower the mast and add the antenna and put it back up. The taut line hitch makes adjusting the guy ropes much easier. Pass the rope around the anchor, wrap the end twice around the standing part of the rope, then one more time above that. The last turn can be made with a doubled end to make it easier to untie. The knot can be slid along the rope by hand when it is not under tension, then will hold once tension is applied. To take down the mast, pick up the base and move it far enough sideways so that the mast is leaning against two of the guy ropes. Then, take off the section starting at the bottom. If the joints are loose enough, the sections may fall off on their own. Seven sections of mass make a convenient bundle. Other numbers of sections may be better stored in a bag.
The guy ropes are all wound in bundles across my hand, as shown in the video on winding ropes. This is easy to do and helps to avoid tangles. All packed up and ready to go. For more information, go to www.practicalantennas.com. Thank you for watching.